Hey guys, it's Caitlin and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be showing you guys what I got for my 15th birthday. Um, I'm just gonna show you some things that my friends and families got me. Thank you so much to everyone who got me a gift or said happy birthday to me. Um, I really appreciate it and you know basic YouTube disclaimer when doing a haul. Um, I just want to film this because I literally do this every year. It's so much fun. And I love just compiling all this stuff and putting it into a video so I can look back on it and show you guys. So, yeah. Um, subscribe, like, and comment, and let's get started. Also, please don't mind my messy room in the background. I have a bunch of school stuff and, like, my birthday stuff. Oh, there's a dog barking really loudly outside so ignore that too but um we're gonna start off with what my parents got me so yes i'm just gonna show this first um i went to the mall with my mom like a month or two ago and i got some new shoes converse i got black high top converse i'm so excited i've been wearing these for so long they're so cute um perfect for like fall and I've been needing some new shoes so I got these and I'm super super excited to wear them and make some cute outfits out of them this bag of stuff is just a bunch of things that my parents got me so I'm just pulling this one out first I actually got a hairbrush this is like to brush your hair when it's wet um it's good for if you have really thick hair like me my mom actually has one of these brushes um and i always scale it from her so now i have my own and it's pink literally my favorite color ever so cute um i got this little thing of stickers um yeah they're just like cute little aesthetic stickers hold on i'll put these to the side to add to my sticker collection um Oh, I got this really cute, like, oversized brown zip-up hoodie. I can't wait to wear this, like, to school and maybe even, like, to bed. It just looks so comfy. Like, I just want to put it on right now, but it's too hot. Um, but it's super cute. I love the color. Like, I've been wanting some more clothes, like, this color because it was super, like, trendy. And I think it's perfect again for fall, which is coming up so soon. So excited. I love the fall aesthetic. I don't love going to school, but I love the season aesthetic, I guess you could say. My mom got me this book, Regretting You, by Colleen Hoover. I can add it to my bookshelf. Um, I love Colleen Hoover's writing. This is her, like, one of her young adult books. So, perfect. Um, and I've heard really good things about it. And I've just been dying to read this forever. And I want to, like, annotate it and, like, go all in while reading this. Um, I think I'm going to be doing a book haul soon on my book channel. So, stay tuned for that. Go subscribe. Um, but... Yeah, I'll go more in depth on what this is about if you want to see that and a few more books that I'll show later. Um, next is another piece of clothing. It's this long sleeve t-shirt. Um, it says California on it and has like a car or something, Los Angeles. I'm not really sure, but it's really cute. And I think I can make some cute outfits out of this. I feel like it would go with the jeans I'm wearing right now. Yeah, yeah. I am really obsessed with these. These are from Sheen as well, and they are black sweatpants, but they have this little, like, drippy, smiley face on them. I think that's so cute, and, like, a way to spice up a normal pair of sweatpants by adding like, just, like, a cute, small design on it. I love it. I can't wait to wear these, too. I'll probably wear them to school. <laughs> and then, oh, this is a, like, graphic tee Looney Tunes from, like, Walmart. I saw this at the store, and I wanted it, and my mom said no, but then she ended up getting it for me for my birthday. And I love the color. It's just like a light blue. I'll probably wear this to bed or maybe like for a picture or something because it's it's cute. And yeah, I've never ever watched any Looney Tunes, but the the design is really adorable. So yes, got this Tarte concealer because the concealer I have is getting old and kind of crusty, and I need a new one. So I have that now. Perfect. Um, and then these are really cute. I got these little affirmation cards. Um, I saw like, I think it was Sadie Albus maybe, um, had these in one of her vlogs and I thought that was such a cute idea. Like, 
you just read one every day or like not every day like just whenever you want a positive affirmation and i just think it's so cute and like you can really connect it to your life i don't i don't know but yeah they're cute and i want to put this somewhere in my room so this is probably one of my favorite things ever it's so so adorable it is this green knit flower like sweater and i want more sweaters i barely have any and i like I don't want to be one of those like Pinterest girls who has like a ton of sweaters and you wear them with like baggy jeans. <gasps> They're so cute and I love the color of this one. This is like besides pink, my favorite color is like this sage green. I cannot wait to wear this. It's so cute. Oh, this is a really good one. Okay, so this is like a book related piece of clothing. It's an Algen Algen. How do you even say that? I just realized I don't know how to say that. Algen Academy t-shirt from the raven cycle series i literally yeah i literally don't know how to pronounce it but <laughs> yeah i go there that's my school it's definitely not an all boys private school or anything what no <laughs> so yeah i just wanted merch from that series because it's one of my favorite series last but not least is this tape roller like it's double-sided um and it's perfect for like journaling you know just projects different things yeah this is the stuff from my parents let's move on to some stuff my friends got me so me and my friend kelsey had like a sort of like little joint party with our close group of friends and i'm gonna show you what some of them got for me i'm gonna start off with kelsey's because it was her party too and we got each other gifts um so she made me a card <laughs> And she also got me a book that I've been wanting to read called Love in Other Words by Christina Lauren. I love the cover so much. Like, can we just appreciate it? It's so simplistic and cute. And, like, I just can't wait to read it and understand what the title, not the title, the pictures mean. Um, but this is a lot of people's, like, favorite book ever. And I want to be one of those people because it sounds really good. Um, so, yeah, got that. She got me some Stranger Things to go. Oh my goodness, I love Stranger Things. It's one of my favorite shows ever. And I don't have any Stranger Things stickers. So, I love these. And then she got me a bunch of claw clips. Which I need. I love claw clips. My hair sometimes is so annoying and doesn't stay in claw clips. But these ones are like a little bit bigger. So they'll probably work for my hair. And they're also like a bunch of different colors and like shapes. Like I don't have any like this. All mine are just like simple ones. Um... Yeah, ooh, and this one, yeah. There's a good amount in here, and yeah. So thank you to Kelsey. Let's do Audrina next. So she got me this cute, in this cute little Starbucks cup, which I think is adorable because she got me a Starbucks gift card um, and also some gum, which I did not know Starbucks had gum. That's, like, actually really cool. I love gum. Um, and a little chapstick. So thank you to her as well. Um let's do emily's now so she got us this like beer bradley oops i just knocked over my other gifts um so came with this cup which i love how like it's a it's really tall so you can fit a lot of water in this or i might use it for iced tea because i have an iced tea obsession at the moment um but it's super cute tumbler cup and this really soft fuzzy cute blanket which i absolutely love i feel like it's really cute for like maybe like the winter time i don't know but it's so soft and i am absolutely obsessed with it and yeah and she made me a card too so thank you em and last but not least for my friends we have julia's gift so she got me a book too um and it is confessed by colleen hoover she actually likes reading too and she read this and she enjoyed it and we both like colleen hoover books so perfect i can't wait to read this and then tell her about it how i like it and yes she got me a starbucks gift card too which i cannot wait to use i need to go starbucks soon <laughs> oh this is actually this is a really funny she got me and kelsey both these little like cup things that you like drink out of that's so cute <laughs> um oh she got me some little post-it sticky tabs for annotating books super cute i love the colors of this one i don't think i have had any that are these colors so yes and last but not least sour patch kids literally my favorite candy ever so 
Next, um, my aunt and uncle got me a Amazon gift card, which I can't wait to use and spend on books. And next, my, or what my grandparents got me. Most of these are books, so if you, like, aren't interested in books, um, too bad. I'm gonna show you them anyway. But if you want more in-depth, again, go check out my booktube account that I don't even know if I'm gonna stick with, but I just wanted to make a separate account for books just because I thought it would be fun. But I don't know. I really don't. I don't know. We'll see. But, okay. So, here's our little stack of books. So, starting off at the top, we have Malibu Rising by Taylor Jenkins Reid. This woman is the author of my favorite book ever, Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. And this book actually um follows, like, one of the husbands from that book, but, like, his family story. And he's, like, not a nice character in that book, but this is, like, about his whole family and like they throw this big party i don't know sorry i didn't i said i wouldn't get into detail but the cover is just so cute like i love it okay anyways next oh bone crier's moon by katherine purdy i don't know if i said that right but i'm super excited to read this young adult fantasy the cover is also stunning um this next book is called the murder game by carrie doyle um it's a murder mystery if you can't tell the 57 bus i heard this i saw this like on goodreads and it just sounded really interesting and i believe it's like non-fiction which i don't read a lot of but i want to start reading some like non-fiction type of books um and also league of liars which is kind of new i don't know if it came out this year or last year but i heard about it and i heard it was like similar to six of crows which i love that book it's by Astrid Scolo T. I don't know. I can't say names. <laughs> but yeah, those are for my grandparents. Oh, they also got me some money and then this like curling iron waving thing. I, it has three barrels. I saw Steph Bower use this and her hair is amazing. Like when she curls it, it looks so good. And I want my hair to look like that. And I suck at using like a regular curling iron because I don't know. I just can't get the motion down and my mom always has to do it for me so hopefully this will be a bit easier to use i want to try it out soon but i just straightened it today so i don't know but yeah so that was my birthday haul for 2022 15th birthday i hope you enjoyed watching this video seeing what i got now i have to go put all this stuff away fun but yeah thank you so much for watching and i will see you next time bye